Okay, so last week I posted a video on uh, changing out the fuse for my secondary uh, air injection pump on this 2000 Blazer. And uh, as I mentioned in that video, I feared that the code would come back. And I thought this week I would uh, demonstrate the uh, use of this TopTac TP280. I paid about $60 for this some years ago on eBay. You can certainly spend a lot more money and a little bit less, but uh, this little scanner here does pretty much everything I need it to do. So let's go ahead and show you how to scan that. Okay, so I'm underneath the dash on the driver's side of the vehicle, and you can see this is the plug, and this is where I need to go. These pins can bend quite easily. I don't know if you can see that, but they're real flat, so you want to be definitely straight on when you plug it in. If you just heard this, you get to a place where you can actually see it here. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is actually turn the vehicle into the run position. I'm not going to start it, I'm just going to turn the key on. Wait for it to stop here. Okay, I'm going to click read. I'm going to click fun, and as I suspected, it's a secondary air injection uh, system, which is the, uh, if you watch the video I posted last week, I'm going to have to change out uh, an air pump uh, that's part of the emission system. It's a known issue on these vehicles, um, but what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go back, okay, and I'm going to erase the data. Okay, so that's how easy, easy it is to clear the code. Um, that's one reason to have a, uh, a scanner like this. If you do have a check engine light on your vehicle, you know, you might just want to find out what it is yourself uh, before you take it to the shop. Okay, another handy feature of this scanner is the ability to view the uh, vehicle's live data. You can view things such as the uh, coolant temperature, uh, the O2 sensor uh, readings, the throttle position sensor, ignition advance, mass airflow, all those types of things, air intake temperature. Um, so manifold pressure, uh, so those kinds of things uh, can be handy in trying to diagnose, you know, if you've got a bad sensor or what's going on with it. I'm just going to give it some gas here so we can see if something changes. Okay. So you can see the throttle position I had at 5.4. Uh, the ignition advance had changed. The RPMs obviously increased significantly. So there you have it. It's the TopTac TP280. It's a handy little tool uh, for any kind of shade tree mechanic or do-it-yourselfer. Um, it's been helpful. It's cost me about $60. And the nice thing is when you do get a uh, you know a check engine light trouble code, you can scan it yourself and see what it is. You know rather than bring it to your mechanic. And maybe uh, you know on a lot of these issues you can resolve them yourself. So. Hopefully this was helpful. Uh, leave questions and comments below.